3D printers have come a long way in a short time. It wasn't that long ago that companies started using them to 3D print small prototype parts. And now, people everywhere are doing the same. But I always thought you could only 3D print small items, as most printers I knew of were only small desktop sized printers. How little did I know, as one man used a 3D printer to print his own full size identical body twin. Meet Simon Sorensen from Sweden, who runs the YouTube channel RC Life On, who specializes in using 3D printers to create all kinds of amazing things, and in this case, created a 3D printed full body twin. To create the full size twin, Simon started by having himself scanned. Now unlike professional scanning rigs used to create models for CGI, this was a hand scanner, but it actually did a good job getting all the details on Simon's face and clothes. After Simon had a file of the completed scan, a friend of his loaned him an industrial 3D printer, which can print objects up to one meter high. Simon then proceeded to print portions of his body double, one piece at a time. Oh, and in case you're wondering, yes, they are hollow inside, just the ends of each piece are solid. Once all the parts had finished printing, Simon stuck them together using an adhesive. Now if you're wondering why the printed twin has white, gold and grey colours, I think you will find Simon was using any printing material he had available to use at the time but that had no bearing on the final design as it ends up getting painted. Once it was finally assembled, Simon painted his twin with an undercoat, but left the actual final painting to an artist friend of his. The main reason Simon created the 3D printed twin was he wanted to see if he could set it up with a donation hat and a sign that read donate if you look twice. His intentions were not to fool the public into donating lots of money, but just to see the reactions of people when they saw the body twin for the first time and realized it was not a real person. I was going to tell you all about how long it took to make, but Simon covered this, so I'll let him tell you. Here are some answers of your questions I can imagine being in the comments. How much does he weigh? About 5 kilograms. Isn't Simon 2.0 a little taller than you are? Yes, yes he is. How long time did the 3D printing take? About 200 hours. And how long time did the painting take? About one week. Does he actually look realistic? Both yes and no. If you look close up, it looks like he has some makeup on. If you step back a few meters, it looks pretty darn good. So, if you ever wanted a life-size mannequin of yourself, well, now you know how to do it. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.